Hi, this is the two part video about getting high quality lines in 2020. I'm Raj Tobi, creator of AI Insider, an artificial intelligence powered SEO tool. AI Insider helps you to outrank any competitors. Well, check out our explainer video below. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. I make a video every day. Yesterday, we talked about four methods, and this is the continuity of that. So I will start from number five. Publish ultimate guides. You already know that the only way to move your site to the top of Google is to build high quality backlinks and lots of them. That much is clear, but how do you get other sites to actually link to you? Answer is ultimate guides. Seriously, ultimate guides are absolute magnets. Why do ultimate guides work so well? First, comprehensive guides tend to contain a lot of content on a single page. I'm talking about guides with more than 400 words. According to lots of SEO ranking factor studies, including ours, long form content tends to perform better in Google than short articles. Also, Ultimate Guide can cover entire topic on a single page. And because your guide is the go-to resource for a topic, people will link to it whenever they write about that topic on their blog. Here's exactly how to create an Ultimate Guide step by step. Your first step is to find a topic for your guide. This is important. You want to choose a popular topic that hasn't been covered to death already. In other words, you don't want to publish the 18th ultimate guide on a topic. Instead, choose a topic that hasn't been covered to death yet. Number two, next, outline your ultimate guide. This is easy. Just list out top subtopics that make your target larger topic. Lastly, write your ultimate guide. And remember, don't be afraid to cover everything there is to know about a topic. That way your guide will be seen as the definite resource. Number six, use branded strategies and techniques. Remember no, strategy number three from this guide? You might have noticed that I didn't just outline the strategy, I also named it. This wasn't the first time that I mentioned the moving man method in a blog post. How about an example? Remit Sethi created a strategy for, look, for looking like a rock star at meetings called the briefcase technique. And because Ramit named his strategy, he got a bunch of amazing links. Now that you have seen how well this can work, it's time to cover the specific steps. Step number one, develop a unique strategy, tip or tactic. This sounds hard, but it isn't. All you need to do is come up with a strategy that has something unique about it. In other words, the entire strategy doesn't need to be unique. Step number two, name your strategy. Just make sure the name describes what your strategy does. Other than that, try to use one of these words in your strategy name. Method, technique, approach, system, blueprint. You get the idea. Step number three, publish the strategy as part of a blog post. Your last step is to show people that your new strategy actually works. How? Publish your strategy in the form of a blog post, preferably, preferably a case study. That way, people have something to link to when they reference your technique. Strategy number seven, authority resource pages. Resource pages are a link builder's dream. Why? They, these pages that exist solely to link out to the other sites. Here is an example. You might be wondering, okay, that's great. How can I get links from source pages? Like every strategy in this post, I will walk you through the step-by-step -step process. First, you need to find a resource page. Then. That can be tricky, but very people call the resource page a resource page. Instead, people tend to describe their pages with terms like helpful resources, further reading, additional resources, etc. So to find these pages, you just need to search for these terms plus a keyword. Second, now that you have found a resource page, it's time to reach out and nicely ask for a link. The more you personalize your outreach for emails, the more links you'll get. Strategy number eight, Turn brand mentions into quality backlinks. Every once in a while, someone will mention you in a blog post, but won't actually link to your site. See how the person mentioned my site, but didn't link to me. That's called the unlinked brand mention. These mentions are relatively easy to get backlinks from. Why? The author of the post already mentioned you, which means they like you. So you just need to send them this friendly email and you're set. Number nine, send feeler emails. But I've also found that so-called feeler emails increase conversion by 40%. So what are feeler emails? 
Killer emails are messages you send to prospects without asking for a link. You're filling it out. Whether or not there is a, they are receptive to your outreach before you make a link pitch. Here is an example. See how Mike does ask, doesn't ask for a link. Instead, he asks the person if they like to see it first. If they say yes, you send them your pitch. If Mike's case, the filler email got 40% more responses versus asking for a link in the first email. What do you think? So there you have it. Uh, nine process, nine strategy to build high quality backlinks to you. So are you excited to publish an ultimate guide or maybe you want to test your filler emails? Let me know by leaving a comment below right now. You can reach us at www.dcdigitals.com.